Hello, 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 y'all. Sorry, I'm backing out of my parking space. I just want to, uh, first of all, say hello. I feel like I haven't talked to you in forever, and it is because uh, between working full-time and being post-surgery, going back to the grind full-time, and spending every waking second going over my real estate stuff, time has been a little bit of a precious commodity lately, so I apologize for being away. Um... Everything is going great. My recovery is going great. I feel great. I'm back to teaching classes a little, not so much. I won't be back to a full force until August, but I'm feeling great. I'm feeling energized. I'm feeling back to my normal self. Um, real estate school, children cover your ears, is kicking my ass, okay? <laughs> Trying to cram all of this studying in with a full-time plus job is harder than I could have ever imagined. So I'm a little bit stressed out about that at the moment. I'm not going to lie. Um, I have gotten all my coursework done, so now it's just all about cramming for the final and making sure that I know what I'm doing. But I've been taking some of the practice quizzes, not doing so well at those, so I have to go back and reread. And, you know, it's just hard to get back into that college brain for me of memorizing stuff. You know what I mean? It's hard to go from a not school brain to a school brain, if that makes sense. And I haven't been in that school brain in a long, long time. But... Uh, I thought I had my protein shake at work that I was going to do for lunch, and I think someone drank it. So first of all, people, don't drink or eat stuff that's not yours at work. I don't understand that. It's not yours. Don't do it. Like, were we not taught that in elementary school? You don't take something that's not yours, and you definitely don't eat or drink something that's not yours. So that's that. It's a beautiful day. It is absolutely gorgeous. Um, it's been freezing at work, so even with this big jacket on, I feel comfortable. I just don't know what I want to eat, y'all. It's a constant battle. I really don't know. I want a salad, but there's nowhere to get a salad quickly. You know what I mean? Not a good one. And not one with, like, tuna that I'll need on it. I could go to Subway and get a salad, but their salads are kind of gross. Let's get real. I always feel like I come to y'all and I don't know what I'm doing in terms of food and it just becomes me whining about, and I know what I want to eat, but I really don't. Um, I guess I could just get like a fish sandwich from McDonald's. I don't know, but I just figured y'all would want to come along for the ride and have a little chit chat. So yes, just ignore me. I will be done soon. I, I, I anticipate that I'm going to be done with everything in a couple weeks in terms of like doing the exam. Don't know if I'll pass it, but at least I'll take it. And I can always take it again. And then my life will be back to uh, somewhat normal, I hope. But then I guess the whole process starts of trying to do real estate in addition to my full-time job, which apparently is, you know, kind of a hard balance. I kind of want Taco Bell. I'm not going to lie. And I know most of y'all are saying, do it, do it, do it. But do I want to? I want to. Do I need to is the question I should be asking myself. Uh, I don't know, y'all. When I, when I have come to a conclusive decision on what I'm going to eat, I'll come back to you. Because there's no need of me being here for the should I, should not, what should I eat. So let me make up my mind. Uh, and then we'll be back. And we'll talk and we'll eat. Okay, from the Tyler is Lazy file, um, I don't want to get out of the car. So, I think I'm going to go to Long John Silver's. I oh, know. And just, I think they have a Baja fish taco, I think. I've not been there in a long time, but I think they do. And so we're going to try that. I usually would go to Captain D's, but it's on the other side of town. And I'm probably going to get a diet drink. So just prepare yourselves mentally and physically. I'm hungry, though. I just need a little something-something. I'm back to classes. I'm back to teaching my classes. So I did uh, teach a spin class today on the bike. I taught a weight class using very light dumbbells. Um, and I'm going to teach step this afternoon. So I deserve a little something-something, right? And i got to have brain food later for when I go home and start studying again. Which is always exciting. So I've made a decision! <laughs> Good job, me. Not the most healthy decision, but hey, you got to live a little sometimes. Am I right, everybody? And let's get real. You probably don't want to see me eating a salad.
and I've not done an eating video in a really long time. I think the last one I did was the Captain D's video, and that was weeks ago. Well, a week ago. Let's see how fast they are. I'm telling you, some, I'm, I'm, I've been disappointed in fast food these days. It's not so fast. It is food, but it's not fast. The KFC is being remodeled. I'm sure y'all wanted to know that. Hope everybody's having a fabulous day. It is one of those feel-good mood days because it is beautifully perfect outside. And it's not swell. I mean, it's hot, but it's not swelteringly humid today. I don't know what the deal is, but the humidity seems very low. Popcorn shrimp, $1 all day Wednesday. It's Wednesday. What does that mean? You just get popcorn shrimp for a dollar? I'm intrigued. But I want it to be like popcorn shrimp and french fries and all that stuff. It says daily deal starting at a dollar. Popcorn shrimp, one dollar all day Wednesday. I guess we'll find out together. Lord, I think I'm going in the wrong hole. All you can eat Sunday, two piece fish and more. Lord, I've not been here in so long, y'all. Let's see what happens. There we go. Hi, how are you? Good, how are you? Good, what can I get for you? Um, can I get a Baja fish taco, um, a small french fry, and a small Diet Coke? What else can I get for you? That's it. Can I try a fish popcorn shrimp for a dollar today? Sure. Mm. You said a fish taco, a fry, and a walnut drink? Uh, Diet Pepsi. Instead of the fries, can I just do the taco, the shrimp, and a small Diet Pepsi, please? One taco, the shrimp, and a drink. Uh huh. Pepsi. Yeah. Anything else? That's it. Thanks. Five twenty-three. Also, they have Cinepups, which is like a cinnamon hush puppy. Stop it. And they also have deep fried Twinkies. Stop it. But I couldn't go there. It's lunchtime and I still got to teach and I don't want to vomit everywhere. So, let me go through the line. We're going to sit down. I'm going to park somewhere where it's a little bit shady so the sun's not beating in. And we'll be back with taco in hand, honey. We're back. Sorry you're in a different position, but it's so like sunny everywhere that this is the only place you're going to be able to see me and the food. So, I think during the time that I was in line, they had to go out to the Pacific Ocean. They had to catch the fish. They had to descale the fish. They had to gut the fish, clean the fish. They had to uh, freeze the fish. They had to unfreeze the fish, ship the fish, make the fish, mash the corn, make the tortilla, put it on the taco, make the sauce. And then she asked if I wanted tartar sauce, and I thought, honey, I don't have time for you to make it. So, I got a Baja fish taco. And it was a dollar today for shrimp. So, you know, I got a dollar thing of shrimp with a little fork here, honey, and my napkin. So, we're just going to get started. Let's try this shrimp since it was a dollar. There's also the crunchies in here, y'all. Now, let me tell you. It smells pretty shrimpy. I love these. Just the crunchies. The fried stuff. Delicious. And I tell people all the time, Long John Silver is the only meal in Captain D's. You get to eat twice. You get to eat it, and then an hour later, you get it off the roof of your mouth, and you get to eat it again. Diet Pepsi, it's fine. I would rather it be a Diet Coke or sparkling water, but hey. Beggars can't be choosers. Now, it's been a minute since I've had a Baja fish taco. On a Baja fish taco, let me just explain it to you, um, is fish and coleslaw and a sauce. See that? And a fried fish thing. So let's go ahead and take a thumbnail while the person next to me watches. And we're going to get right down to it. And I like this because the tortilla provides a barrier between your fingers and the fried fish. If you're OCD like me and can't handle that, it's great. I 
I tell you, it's pretty good. Let's try some more of this shrimp. Do I really need a fork for this? Probably not. Who gets a side of shrimp? Me, when it's a dollar. Any exciting events you'd like to tell me about? I'm also behind on comments, which y'all know, but I read them all and I love them. So don't quit, quit commenting, please. I promise one day I will catch up on them. But I love seeing comments. They make my day. And here at the Tyler Ramey channel, they're always nice. Let's have another bite, shall we? Oh my gosh, that's good, y'all. I could almost eat two. Not going to, but I could almost. I want more of the crunchies. See that? You see that oil and grease? That's a true sign that it's good. Now this will be the best spot because this has the most coleslaw and sauce and fish ratio to tortilla. Mm. It's just good. My brother secretly watches these videos. Grant, we're on to your games. We're on to your secret. And you said something the other day, like, if you don't, stop. Anyway, I don't remember, but he was making fun of me in these videos. Sorry, Grant. He's so embarrassed. My brother, y'all, could not be more different to me if he tried. He's a sports rider. Does that tell you anything? There is nothing like a fork full of the Krispies. People are walking. Mm. If loving these is wrong, I don't want to be right. It's that crunch. Is anyone excited like me from Mamma Mia 2? Here we go again. I'm so excited. I'm going to see it tomorrow night, even if I had to go by myself. I'm going to take a break from studying. It's probably going to be bad. But Cher's in it. Cher sings Fernando. So, that right there alone is worth the price of admission, in my opinion. I mean, you cannot go wrong with that. I just, I mean, you just can't. You cannot go wrong with Cher singing Fernando ever. Fernando, Fernando. I can hear the drums. And I'm all in, Cher. I'm all in. It's so good, y'all. We haven't seen a Cher and a uh, Meryl Streep collaboration since Silkwood. Last little bite, Taco. R.I.P. That's just good. I mean, it's just, it's just good. It's just, it is what it is and it's good. Today is the first day I'm back to classes, and I think my appetite is like, ah, as usual. LTS. I'm out of my drink. 
Y'all, that shrimp was good for a dollar. Make me holla. Popcorn shrimp will always make me holler. Dollar or otherwise. Let's bite. Let's just do it. Honey, that was pretty tasty for five dollar. Okay. Um my work is just right down the road. You just want to stay on here until I get back. <coughs> Y'all that grease is making me thirsty. Let's go. Shall we? And you know after long John Silver's honey, you have to have the gun. Because I've got Excuse me, deep fried fish breath. How's that for attractive? On days like this, I would typically be like, I had a really heavy lunch. So for dinner, I'm only gonna have a piece of organic lettuce that was picked by a hippie. But Y'all know that's not how it usually goes. Can I get over? No. I should have gone one more row up. Should I do it? Should I risk it? And do it illegally? Why not? I always choose weird, not good times to do this because I'm usually on film, which is bad. Anyway, it's fine. You saw nothing. So yeah, th today, these are the, usually the dates that I'm like, I'm going to have a really light dinner because I had heavy lunch. And that never works out because by the time I get home, I'm starving again. And I pig out again. So, you know what? I've still got some surgery weight that I need to regain, quote unquote. So, we're just saying that this was part of that effort, right? <clears throat> and that's fine. I didn't get fries. I got a diet drink, so it's basically vegan. We're almost back at the homestead, y'all. And by that, I mean work. It is stunningly beautiful, and I do not want to go back inside. Honey, all that fish grease took off my chapstick. My Burt's Bees. So, yes, I'm very excited about Mamma Mia. Um, I've been listening to the soundtrack. It's on Spotify right now, by the way. And uh, if you're excited about that, let me know. And let me know how you feel about the first Mamma Mia. I'm, I'm always in for a musical. Especially a musical with great music. Tony and I recently, I don't, I can't remember if I talked about this or not, but we went to Barter Theater, which is a local theater here in town. And, oops, is that Charlie? My old boss. I hope so. Um, and we saw Mamma Mia, or not Mamma Mia, good lord, sorry, I'm distracted by my boss behind me, my old boss. Sister Act, and it was fabulous, y'all. Oh my gosh, I loved it. It was absolutely divine. So I highly recommend musicals, especially if you can go and see one in person. All right, we're going to wrap this up. I love you all, and I mean it. Thank you for sticking with me. I promise to upload more frequently. Um, I'm just studying a lot right now. So if I'm not at work, I'm at home studying, and I've just been eating stuff quickly and not thinking about filming it because I haven't had any spare time, and I mean that when I say that. So uh, thank you all for standing behind me. Thank you for all the support, as always, with everything that I do. Um, find me on social media. I have loved seeing all the new Instagram peeps that are adding me in on Facebook. So all that information is down below, but it is uh, Instagram T Ramey one, the number one, uh, Tyler Ramey. You can find me on Facebook and you can also find Tyler Ramey YouTube on Facebook. So just so many possibilities. So friend me on social media. Let's make sure we connect. Uh, don't forget to share my channel. I'm trying to get the word out as best I can. Y'all know I'm trying to get to that 5,000 subscriber limit, honey. And then we're going to do Tyler's Treasures where we're going to drive for, draw for prizes. So do all that jazz. And um, let me fix this really bad parking job. And I will see you guys on the next video. Bye.